Tableau pricing can be confusing to some people simply because it has more than just the visualization tool. Now, in this video, we're going to talk about which license is right for you and also give you some things to think about if you're buying it for your organization. Enjoy. <music> All right, in this video, we're going to talk about the pricing. How much is actually all this going to cost? So if we're talking about free users, um, we're talking about Tableau Public. Oops, hang on, wrong tool. We're talking about Tableau Public and Tableau Public Online. These are freely available. So let's kind of take that out of the conversation for the moment. Okay, um, Tableau CRM, which is relatively new. And again, don't know if I'm going to cover it in this course. I'm going to leave it out for now. This is really kind of the main components, uh, if you ask me. So think of this as broken actually into three particular license bundles okay that's kind of the best way to think about it so the biggest one is what's called tableau creator and tableau creator basically encompasses this whole thing okay that is tableau creator so when you buy the highest level license you will get tableau prep builder which is the data cleansing tool you get tableau desktop which is the visualization tool you'll get bridge which actually lets you do the um the data push to the cloud and then tableau online uh access as well and then tableau server which we'll kind of get into but it's kind of all the same thing so that is your tableau creator then the other things you buy are tableau online on its own. And basically what that means is you kind of have two sets of people. You have creators and you have the audience. So audience members are people like senior management, right? People who don't actually do the data analysis, but they do kind of more down the line decision making, right? Management, maybe it's your coworkers. So your coworkers, you know, wait for you to do the data analysis, go, well, show me the charts and the funding and the budgets, and then they'll take action off your data. So they're your consumers. Consumers don't need to design, which is why the license for the Tableau Online component, which is where they just view the visualization, is really all they need. So this one is, I think, about half the price of Tableau Desktop. We'll go through the pricing, the exact pricing uh, in a second. Um, but that's what most of them will be using. So the typical ratio I see in an organization is probably 1 to 20, right? For every 20-ish people you have, maybe you'll have one or two tableau desktop designers you really don't need a huge amount right um obviously this will fluctuate depending on the actual division itself for example i've been in divisions where um you needed one for every 20 but then i've been in other divisions where you have um, let's say five for every 20 and it, that just means that sometimes some people are more power hungry you got different individuals with different skill sets some of them want to learn more tableau desktop so it's kind of like a kind of moving ratio but generally speaking that's what i see okay so there is one more license type which i didn't add in the original one and it's called tableau viewer okay so Tableau Viewer is a slightly cheaper version of Tableau Online. You haven't got as much functionality, but the difference is, in my opinion, opinion, marginal at the beginning. So I would encourage organizations to start with Tableau Viewer. Um, and if you have, uh, if you need more advanced uses of Tableau Online, then go to Tableau Online. Again, we're going to cover this in way more detail later. It's really hard to kind of get into it too much uh, because you can't see it. Okay, so let's go into the pricing now. So, ch -ch -ch -ch. all right, so here's the pricing. And again, if you want to check this out, there's a link provided. So when you go to the main website, it's really just this button up here, pricing. So Tableau Creator is the one that gives you everything. And that is $70 a month, okay? The thing you got to be careful with is this part. $70 build annually. I really hate how they phrase this. Just be straight up and say it's, you know, 70 by 12, which is 840 US dollars a year. Just say it's 840. I, I've seen this in so many other um, websites and, you know, softwares, um, not just Tableau, but heaps of other ones where they'll say, oh, it's only $5 build annually. Oh, man. It's, which means upfront, you have to pay 840 And this just annoys people because when you're signing up for the first time, you're, you could get confused. You'd be like, oh, it only costs 70 bucks, And then you get the, the bill and it says 840 So anyone from Tableau, if you're listening, please just say 840 You know, if there's only one choice, just say 840 <laughs> You don't have to, you know, be fancy like that. And if you go into this part, 
you'll see what I said, which is basically you get Tableau Desktop, Prep Builder, and then Tableau Online. It doesn't say bridge in here, but it is included. Okay, so if now you're looking at organizations, okay, and you have two options. And remember what I said where you've got Tableau Server or Tableau Online. Tableau Server, you control the servers. Tableau Online, you're using Tableau Servers. So at the beginning, you're probably going to be using this. And you'll notice that Tableau Explorer and Viewer is a few dollars more, right? And those few extra dollars really covers the cost of using their server. Okay, so let's go here to Tableau Online. So you've got your Tableau Creator, again, gives you everything. Tableau Explorer, okay? So Tableau Explorer only gives you Tableau Online. Again, my a pet peeve of mine, why call it Explorer if you're only getting one thing? Just call it a Tableau Online license, right? Uh, anyways, <sighs> I've been doing this too long. So the other one is the Tableau Viewer. And basically, the Tableau Viewer is a cheaper version. You can see it's about one-third the price of Tableau Explorer. And the main difference, okay, if I come down here to the comparisons, right, you can see Explorer and Viewer are pretty much the same. And then you kind of get down here. All right, and so these five items are the main difference with some of these, which I'll get to in a second. So if we go here, creating subscriptions for others, not a huge deal. Creating data-driven alerts, not a huge deal. Uh, editing workbooks, publishing workbooks, again, not a big deal. So at, at the beginning, stick with the viewer, right? Once you get more um, kind of heavy duty and more skilled users, you want to give them some of this extra functional, uh, functionality, but it's not a deal breaker, okay? So just kind of uh, operate, I would say, I would suggest operate it like a lean startup. Pay as little as you can and get into the proof of concepts. So you got that Tableau server, which is a little bit um, less because you're providing your own server. Okay, so basically what happens is in terms of the purchasing process, um, you click buy now. Buy now? No, I'm joking. Uh, so by now you've got a few bundles here um, that you can possibly do, which is, you know, one creator and you get five viewers or one creator and two explorers. Uh, this is probably a good start for a small group. Okay, so even if your division is like 100 people, um, if you're testing Tableau for the first time for your organization, I would say start here um, because it just gets it off slowly, you know, getting people's buy-in slowly. And you can see here, build annually 1680. Okay, this is in US dollar. So you can follow that one or if you go down here, right, you can actually change how many you want if you want something a little bit more and they'll do all the pricing for you. So once you've done this, right and you kind of continue on to the next stage which is continue to contact and billing right you do all the invoicing and the payment cool right so once that is finished right it, the payments made you will get an email from uh, tableau with you know all the paperwork and stuff and then the license keys so what happens is with the license license keys once you've installed tableau let me go here right it's either when you open it for the first time it's going to say um, register Tableau and then that's where you kind of put your serial key in but if you went for the trial version you know you kind of want to have that menu come up what you do is you go to help manage product key so once you go in there it'll have a button saying activate put in your license key it does some thinking talks to the server goes through Singapore underground in France I don't know whatever and then it activates and then you're ready to use it okay so that's basically the pricing and the purchasing process if you have any issues just get in touch with me or leave a comment or something like that um, and i'll explain in more detail but until next time hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you at the next video